So, like, like it's new -ish. Carn the Great new -ish. Creator changed Tron. Yeah. Like, legitimately. Like, this this sort of, like, toolbox sideboard thing didn't exist before Carn the Great Creator. That's true. So, um, that's the new version of Tron. But, War of the Spark was before Modern Horizon, like, 1 and 2, which ruined... <laughs> which ruined uh, John. So this is a little bit more, like, in the wheelhouse of what could have actually happened. Circa yes, this is a little bit 2018 more 2018 through 2019. Yes. Um, this is the blast from the past bonus round. So uh, if there were no Modern Horizons one and two, this would be the meta right now. Yeah. Also, <laughs> since my sideboard is outdated, there is some Tron spikes. <laughs> yeah. Also, uh, yeah. No, you'll see it. Well, you'll yeah. hopefully see. We'll see for sure. Um, I can. I don't have to keep as like perfect hands against uh, Chris anymore. Yeah. Because <laughs> I had to keep legitimately perfect hands against uh, Thomas. Other, otherwise, I would just lose turn three. But this is good, so I will keep this. All right, I had one the die. We are going to Black Wave Cliffs and Inquisition. Oh, that's uh, great. I know what you're going to pick. Oh, is this an Expedition map? Yeah, it is an Expedition map. Oh, my goodness. Well, <laughs> maybe we'll get rid of that. Yep. <clears throat> you want to play open just so I don't have to remember all of that? Sure. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. All right, go ahead. That is Inquisition of Fog. I'm going to start off with this forest. Oh, yeah. My turn? Yep. Nice. Uh, that was not the world's greatest draw. Okay. Go ahead. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only the finest. Only the finest. For, uh, yeah, for our uh, modern, tr uh, modern Traub buy list. Like this is the this is the buy deck. If people uh, if we have uneven uh, matches, then yeah. Tron joins the format. <laughs> yeah. Um, I am going to Ancient Storms. Sure. That's a good draw. That's a good draw. Out of sight. Out of mind. Oh, yeah. Do you want to move it in? There you go. Just move the graveyard so I can Underneath see it. Underneath Gigantha? Okay, no, you put Gigantha like, over here. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Gigantha chills over there. Nobody puts Gigantha in. A oh, corner. I might cast Gigantha in this game. <laughs> this game is <laughs> a very realistic possibility Gigantha gets cast. Uh, I'm going to take a Chromatic Star from uh, this sure. and put these on the bottom. Uh, then I'm gonna play this Urza's Tower, and I'm gonna cast this Chromatic Star. Yeah. Go ahead. Well, this is the world's slowest start. That's good for me. Even after you got my map. Go ahead. My hand was decent, but then the draws have been, let's say, so far. You're right. This is the slowest start <laughs> you could have. Well, there's a bunch. Like, uh, you can Charm Boy people. Yeah. You can Bloodbraid Elf people. You can play Season Pyro to get cards. You have Lilies that just kind of give you an inevitability. No. No. Uh, I'm going to. You play uh, Season Pyromancer, which gets you cards and stuff. Crack Chromatic Star for the green. Yep. Cycle it. Drop. Uh, I'm going to play this Urza's Mine, and then I'm going to cast this Oblivion Stone into my hand. Yeah. Go ahead. I don't like that. That's some uh, future protection. Uh, future proofing my... Uh, what is with these draws? It is. In fact, uh, I don't know if you mainboard Colgan's Command. 
That is definitely a prime Polygon's command target. What are we doing? Okay, we're gonna fetch. Mm -hmm. Just go get. Doesn't really matter. We'll just take a forest. So you have a mine and a tower. Yeah, I have two thirds. I have I have all of Tron. Plus <laughs> a, <laughs> if this forest was part of Tron. Tron. <laughs> uh, we're gonna BBE. Mm, that's bad for me. Cascade. Cascade. Oh, if only. Polygon's command. Now I like that. That's good. Maybe we're gonna destroy. Maybe we're gonna destroy an artifact here. I think we are. And then maybe we will make you discard a card. Okay. You did. I I am actually kind of upset about that. Uh, I think I'm gonna discard this warping though. I don't think it's gonna. And I also have three. Uh, yeah, take three. Go ahead. I wouldn't have minded if that Blood Raid Elf was underneath the cold. So then I could do it again next turn. That would have been really nice. But I'm not going to complain. Uh, drop. This is the deck that does that. It is the one behind the saying. Um, so we're going to Chromatic Sphere. Sure. I need to, I think, try and Tron right now. So I'm going to Chromatic Sphere for green. Mm -hmm. Draw close, but not quite there. That's not good for me. So I'm he gonna, is missing a power plant. So I'm going to companion Gigantha into, into my hand. There you go. Go ahead. Gigantha I may, told you, it's, it's, may see play this it, game. it might see play next turn. <laughs> <laughs> it does. <laughs> I will swing with the Blood Raid Elf. Uh, let's do Ren and Six. Oof. Let's go back and get this Verdant Catacombs. Uh, then I will pass. Come on, Power Plant. Come on, Power Plant. No Power Plant. Here it comes! Yeah. Here it comes! Moo! Unfortunately, I am gonna go get a land and make you sack that. Yeah. With the new Riveteer's charm. Whoa. No. It's the Boomer Jund in spirit. It, yeah, it is. That's, it, it's, <laughs> see, it's allowed. <laughs> this, see, Boomer Jund is not a deck, deck. it's a lifestyle. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. I did choose that. And you know what? I said it wouldn't make the deck, but it's kind of good. I mean, like, the deck shouldn't exist, really, I guess, technically. <laughs> it kills. Oh, yeah. Every day, like, it, 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 it was basically designed for this exact moment. Um, that was its moment to shine. Uh, got another land. These cards kind of suck. Swing for three. Gonna take three. Just blood, blood braid beats till I die. Oh, well, plus this and get this burden back again. He might just emblem. He might emblem this one. <laughs> <in six. laughs> yeah. Go ahead, Ren and six. Yeah. Okay. You get a land back from the bin, which would be nice if I had a peat land because that's where it's at its best. If I draw a land, I'm okay. Any land is good. Uh, if I draw like a seven or eight drop, I'm in trouble. That was the seven or eight drop tap. Nope, that oh. is an ancient stirring tra <laughs> tap. Not bad, not bad. Uh -oh. Look at the top five cards. 
Uh oh. Swing and a miss times five. I am going to put this Urza's power plant into my hand. That seems like a good idea. That seems like a very good idea. I mean, I'm going to put all of these cards on the bottom. We're in it, baby. He is, he is back. Back again. So, now I have six, five mana to work with. Uh, six, yeah. And yet, I can only cast one spell this turn. <laughs> <laughs> Four cards in hand, one spell a turn. Um, am kind of worried about just dropping a card, so I think I am going to tap, tap two and play a uh, Worm Coil Engine. That card is massively annoying. Go ahead. Oh my god. <laughs> and the tides have turned. Oh jeez. I think I just need to... I'll wait. I'll need to work through it. I think we need to work through it. I'll make mm -hmm. you sack the worm coil. Okay. So and I got two tokens. Yeah. And they're they're get... death touch and first death, strike? Death touch and first strike. I'll have... kill the first striker. Okay. Yeah, so no, have... it's death touch and lifelink. Oh, lifelink. I'll kill the... The lifelinker. I'll kill the lifelinker, yeah. yeah. So this is a death touch 3-3. Three, three. And then I'll push the other one. Oh my god. And then I'll <laughs> crack this and go get a land. <laughs> <laughs> All those cards that were useless were suddenly useful. Yeah. All I needed to do was play a creature. Uh, find the land to play? Or like, do I have all of them? I haven't drawn one of my big threats this game yet, which is a little bit frustrating. All right. I'm worried about, oh. I'm worried about big threats. I'm worried about big threats? Yeah. There's, a, there's only one of those. Oh, okay. All right, I will draw. Oh my god! Don't let, don't let Isaac have any. <laughs> this is infuriating. I will swing for three. Uh, two, three. It's fine. We'll get a verdant back. Play the verdant. Go ahead. Okay. I feel like he's saving his gas because I have an all his dust in hand. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this seems good right now, so I'm going to cast Ancient Stirrings. Yeah. Although... What I ended up getting was not good. Um, I think it's just going to be... I mean, I guess it's okay. I'm going to get this expedition map. Okay. Uh, I'm going to tower and search for a tower. You can do it until Karn tells you. I think I really cannot delay on this. I have very precious life total, and I need to save it. So I'm going to all his dust right now. It's everything, right? All non non-colored permanent uh, permanents. Yeah. yeah. To the bin they go. I'm gonna do this again. 
running out of lands, I think. Mm -hmm. I don't even know how many like fetchable ones I have left. One or two. Mm -hmm. That's good for me, I guess. Well, no, it's bad for me because I want <laughs> then, you. Then I want there's you only to, gas. I want you to shock yourself. Then there's only gas. Yeah. All right. I guess that's the worst part of the Brennan's so. Old draw. That was, on the other hand, uh -oh. a good draw. Another blood rate off. Mm -hmm. Cascade. That's awful for me. Bolt you. That's super awful for me. I'm going to die. And I will swing for three more. And I'll play another land. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> well, it depends on what I draw, but I think um, my next turn is going to be interesting. Okay. So. What do you got for me? Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to Karn Liberated. <laughs> That's a good play. I'm going to exile this uh, Blood Break Off. Goodbye, friend. Uh, I'm going to... Uh, no, don't worry about it. I'm going to oh. Karn Liberate. <laughs> 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 I'm going to plus and uh, get rid of that card in your hand. Another one. Okay, that's bad for me. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh, exiled. Yeah. It is exiled. Um, I, I probably have to, because like it's my turn. as soon as possible. Bolt, bolt, bolt. Yeah, because elf, elf, elf. Yeah, literally anything can. Yeah, bloodbraid elf or bolt. Redraw. Redraw. Baby. Redraw. 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 <laughs> No, he's too big. <laughs> Why are you looking at my board? <laughs> Stop. Is it the way you used to? I think I just like have to slam it and force you to. You have to slam it because I'm getting rid of it. Yes. Yeah. I'm getting rid of it regardless. Go ahead. He's big. He's big. more than two. Big. Um. Much more than two. The lazy alt, at least. Uh, yeah, let's... Uh, uh, power plant floating uh, for chromatic yeah. sphere. Uh, use the floating mana. Turn it into a green, draw a card. Come on, baby. Use that green to play Ancient Stirrings. <laughs> let's go. One, two, three, four, five. We got... Uh, Karn the Great Creator. Uh -oh. We might be in it. Uh oh. No. So close. <laughs> so close. Uh, I think I'm going to tap this. Tap Doing this. Doing so many things. Uh, play Karn the Great Creator. Sounds good. Uh, negative three. Take a gander at my sideboard. Yep. Seems reasonable. Can I gain life in this sideboard? Please, sideboard. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Still got draws to the win. There are it's one, two, three, four. Uh, a lot. A lot. Land creature, planeswalker, instant, sorcery, he's artifact, played, I'm he, assuming. He's played two blood braid elves, one lightning bolt. And he has Coligan's command in there, so I'm worried about a couple we've got, things. We've got a bunch of draws to a win. Yeah. He's got nothing in hand, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm more worried about targeted spells. So I'm going to grab this Witchbane Orb. Witchbane Orb. <laughs> the Tinworm is a battlefield. Destroy all curses attached to you. You have Hexproof. <laughs> and I'm going to play a Witchbane Orb. Now... Polygon's command. Can I choose? To, I can't choose to target you and destroy the artifact at the same Correct. time because you would have hexproof. So yes, that's pretty good. Uh, and then I'm gonna kill this because I have to. Yes. Uh, and then I'm gonna pass the turn. Bloodbraid Elf wins you the game. Not a blood braid elf. Keep <laughs> drawing lands. I'm no, o I'm okay for now. This is ridiculous. You only have that many, and you've like gone to find a bunch. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. I'm in trouble. Okay, 
we we we're in it. We can do this. Uh, on top of keep draw. Yeah. Oh my god. I think that's game. I don't Is know. It? I don't know how you can recover from this. Drag test. <laughs> yeah, we're good. <laughs> no. Take a while. I got it. Oh yeah, press a uh, press a button on that camera. Any button. Thank you. Oh my God. That was close. Two life. That was very close. Come on. <laughs> yeah, you had three draws where you just drew a land, so that was unfortunate. Three of my last four cards were Lilies too. Oh. Uh, That's so. Oh, why you why are you looking at the deck order? Oh, I was just checking my deck afterwards. I'm doing my sideboarding now. Mm -hmm. Luckily, I don't have to bother with that because my sideboard is my deck. Yeah, your sideboard is just there. And I don't think I need to sideboard in. Like, I have other sideboard cards. I have Force of Vigor and Nature's Plan. I don't need, think I need any of these. Oh, in. yes, I'm excited. Oh, no. The Spice incoming. Incoming. Gigantha did their job. Aid to removal spell is perfect. 10 out of 10 deer. Was the best elemental elk. Came in with a big moo and died. <laughs> <laughs> Went out in a blaze of glory. Cut that. Yeah. Yeah. New instant speed worse fatal push? It's not better fatal push. I did a write up on our on our website, under the battlefield.ca about cut down. You can read it. It uh, is definitely a worse fatal push. That requires speeding. Yes. Um, yeah, it's it's fatal push number like five and six that you can like put in your sideboard and that's it's that's there basically if you it. Need it's it. it's redundancy because like the target pool of cut down is so much less than fatal. Yeah, like, the problem is even DRC can just get around it, right? Like, it ends up being six. That's a little annoying. Um, I think it's fine as, like, a two of in the sideboard. Mm -hmm. That's my uh, that's my assessment on it. What's up, Thomas? He's, he's there. I don't know. Do you think any more of it than that? I don't think any more of it than no. that. No. Um... Yeah, it's just like what I said in the article was like there was a time where two threes performed like blood braid out. Like that's a two three. Yeah. You can kill that with. It is a three two. Oh, sorry, it's a three two. <laughs> like the time of that power toughness is at that mana cost yeah. is long gone. Yeah. Like most three drops now are three threes. Yeah. Oh, and, at least. Yeah. Like two drops are three threes. Like, yeah. I will take the play, and I hope I get to play my sideboard. Just to, just to get a smile in. I forgot there was still Tron hate in it. <laughs> Alright, well, this is interesting. I guess we will go with this. Uh, I'm on the draw. This is about him. I have two of the same Tron land, and... This is a very Jundy kind of starting hand. Oh. Oh, I'm about to. Mm -hmm. He's going to get jundered right out. I don't have my sideboard cards. I was thinking of mulling to it just because it would be fun. <laughs> Two. This is better. So we're going to keep this and... Drop this, I think. Final answer? Final answer. Go ahead. Chalk. Oof. Uh-oh. Inquisition. No! Second verse, same as the first. Well, that'll <laughs> go away. What does this thing do anyway? Target creature with power, toughness, one or less. Honor a sorcery. <laughs> too, nice. too late. <laughs> Do you play Dark Confidant? 
I have a one of Dark Dang. Confidant in the deck. So I don't think Warping Whale. Spice. I don't think Warping Whale actually kills anything in your deck. Yeah. Uh, go ahead. I think we talk again. Oh, excellent. I don't have to even do anything. Yeah, we play the board. Go ahead. He's got an artifact and a sorcery. It's all online for him. Maybe I'll put a counter just so like the screen can like <laughs> the people in watching know what it's at. Uh I'm gonna play this forest. I'm gonna play this chromatic star. Um, I think it was a faster. Go ahead. Draw. Let's play a Verdant. We will fetch. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But uh, it looks like I'm slowly going to lose the race. At this point, because uh, uh, three power Tarmogoyf is tough. Do I need to? I'd have to splash red. Is there a fireball that's in green? Uh, yeah. yeah, we'll shock this. Hurricane. I don't think any of those are modern. Would you? It does hit me too. Yeah. Orping Which Whale I do. Is two mana. Warping Whale is two mana and currently not available mm. for me to cast. <laughs> Let's. Inquisition? Thoughts. Well, we got some hits. <laughs> I think we have to take the Karn just because that's like the only thing he's even close to casting. I am actually closer to casting Karn the Great Creator. Uh, uh, Karn is gone. I take two. Yeah. Uh, I will also. I'll take the Warping Whale also. God dang. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Now we have an instant as well. Yeah. So we will swing for a four. Well, that's good. It's a better clock. Go ahead. That's five turns. That's Dan Dan. Goif uh, doing Goif things. I'm going to draw this because yeah. I'm not using it on my turn and I need the mana. Oh. Uh, draw for turn. You know what time it is. Oh, my God. <laughs> Giganta can still block Goif. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Giganta saved me game one. It can happen. It's an eight mana five five, but sometimes you really need an eight mana five five. Uh, we don't have creature in here yet, so let's uh, play Croxa. Now Giganta can no longer block the goy. <laughs> so, um, once again, <laughs> I'm playing with a 14 card sideboard and a 61 card deck. Which Bane Orb? <laughs> 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 which Bane Orb is in my graveyard now, which was supposed to be in my uh, toolbox sideboard, but uh, it's not. Uh, we will swing for five. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. And then I'm going to fetch. Mm -hmm. So here's the thing. Uh, this, this, yeah. See, he, this could still easily turn into a game. All I need to do is draw an Urza's Tower. So, sort of. Uh oh. <laughs> 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 he drew his sideboard card. <laughs> he drew his tag. You're gonna cleansing wildfire. No! <laughs> your plan. <laughs> I do. Well, he gets a land. I draw a card. He gets to go get a basic land. Well, I have basics. See, that's the that's, that's the, the reason you play green. That's the other good thing about this uh, version of Tron is because like you can actually search on these things. <laughs> No, uh, no, no, that is definitely not modern. 
And if it was, oh my god. The cleansing wildfire is in from, uh, you want to cut? No, you're good. <laughs> in from the days when I had to worry about drawing. And I will draw this card. Go ahead. What are you talking about? We've uh, we've established this. It's a it, lifestyle. It's the lifestyle. <laughs> any card that is... Any card that okay. that does dumb things... Yeah, he's very dead. See, <laughs> we dunned him out. And then we had a blood braid off next. Like, what else could you possibly want? Like... All right, let's put my sideboard cards out of my deck because I don't want to draw those. It's 1-1. One, one. See? Interactive, back-and-forth forth magic. magic. These were the good old days. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dave, Dave, Dave and I, 40 years from now, <laughs> are going to be sitting by our fireplaces while everyone's in flying cars. Yeah. Play... Yeah. All of them. Yeah, yeah. yeah they're going to be playing two-face uh, two mobile cards that are lands that flip into four-fours. And we're going to... Yeah, that's right. Sailor Moon comes in out of yeah. nowhere. Yeah, Someone, someone's going to transform their Optimus Prime into uh, <laughs> into vehicle mode. Yeah. Actually, you'd probably play that. Oh, I, I would play that. <laughs> That, that's the one crossover I'm still hoping for. It would fit so well. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Yeah. I think it would just be easy to be like... Hold on. Oh, no. I, I just think it would be like a good design card would just be a transformer because everything's already there. You have dual face modal cards. You can have a robot on one side and a vehicle on the other. It makes sense. Anyways, what am I uh, getting into? This is this is this is Dees. I'm going this, to keep. Um, I'm also going to keep. Good luck, sir. For all the marbles. Uh, I am going to play this Urza's Tower. All right. And I'm going to pass. I am going to draw. It's running out of battery. I'm going to Inquisition. But I will turn up my mic one. Uh, interesting. Cool. Probably because it's low battery. Yep. All right, we'll finish the we'll, game we'll as go quick, quick as possible. Well, we can only take Sylvan's Crimes. Yep. What do you have here? Mine, Tower, and Blastome. And Tower. Okay, cool. Go ahead. Okay. Um, let's play this. Hers is mine. Yeah. Last turn, you know what's going on. Uh, how do I want to play this? How do I want to play this? You didn't have anything big, right? No. I remember, nothing in the hand yet, so you'd have to draw that plus the big thing. Okay, so we're going to fetch and chalk and play a void. Cool. That's bad for me. Uh, I'm going to play this Blast Zone, yep. which might actually save me. That's true. And then this Oblivion Stone, which could very yeah, well, well save me. Defenses are up. Mm hmm. Would you like to. You're good. All right. We have land, sorcery. That's it. Things are two. Alright, I will draw. Uh, let's play. Just tap. Sure, you can remove it. How do you. Check, you check. have to pay to put counters on it, basically. I right? do. Like tap, yeah. play. Whatever. So I can put a counter on it one turn, and yeah, then the next turn, turn I can crack, crack it. Crack it, yeah. Uh, let's go. Like, that's it. Sorry? There was a hum because of the oh, okay. oh, interesting. I'll swing for two. 
Uh, yeah, take two. It's gonna blow up your mind. You can go get your forest and I will draw a card. <laughs> but see, that was, that was what I wanted you to do all along because now I have green, green online. Yeah. It's like you prevented it. You prevented it. Actually, no, because I guess you have to kill a little bit. Okay, so we've got a goy. We do. But the thing is, if you do that, and you were just cleansing wildfire. Yeah. So we can just swing it like Draw. Blast Zone blows up mana cost, I think, right? Equal to the number of counters? Uh, yes. Yeah. I'm going to play this power plant. Because I can just luck sack into it. Yeah. Um... I think I'm okay to take another hit. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you to level 25 Marowak. Level 25 Woo! Marowak, yeah. Oh, clutch. Excellent. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna. I think I'm gonna play this Relic of Progenitus. <laughs> and. Pass the turn. I think I'm going to probably charge up my blast zone. <laughs> Did you get another cleansing wildfire? No. What are you talking about? Uh, I'm going to Inquisition you again. That actually sucks. Um, I mean, it's fine. I'll get rid of the scrying, I guess. Yeah. And you have a tower and you have a Karn. I have a tower and a Karn. Those are both good to know. Uh, let's blow up your power plant. Okay. You can go get a forest. You want to reveal your secret of the wildfires? Yeah, put a, put a cleansing wildfire on the... What do you mean? <laughs> oh, I had two in my hand. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right so off the like, get-go. Like Which means he could have already drawn into owl. another. That I could have. <laughs> How many? What? <laughs> you play three in your sideboard? No. Oh, no. <laughs> what are you talking about? Oh, no. <laughs> you... Oh, no. Uh, do we have anything other than sorcery and land? No. Is it really only sorcery yes. and land? Yes. <laughs> wow, that's so lame. I swing for two. <laughs> Is it? Oh, it was three, wasn't it? Do I get the land? You get a life back. Do you get? Do I get the land tapped or untapped? Uh, go ahead on the battlefield tapped. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna put into blast zone. Yeah. All you. Uh, draw for I feel turn. Like Goyf is not long for this world. Uh, yeah, I. I think I'm just gonna kill that Tarma Goyf and. I could do that at any time. You could. But Tarmogoyf will Unless kill... Unless it says that sorcery speed, but I don't think it does. It doesn't. Yeah. So I will let you do what you do. Peace out, Thomas! Is that two towers now? I have two towers. Nice. Yeah. Yep. And... I think it was the interactive... Jun v Tron play, I think, that yep. that put, put the stream over yeah. the top. Uh, yeah, we know this person. I don't know who it is, but we know them. They follow all of our things. Nice. But it does, it does a lot of things. He has 40 points. He can pick two. It's me? Yeah, you're up. I wonder what he could be doing. It could be anything. Maybe. I'll go to combat and swing with the Goyf. I can take two. Okay. Okay. He's getting cute. Um, I think we, I think we just pass. Uh, yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to kill that Tarmogoyf. <laughs> All right. I don't want it to be there anymore. Goyf is gone. Gone forever. Yep. Goodbye. Uh, cool. I'm going to draw. Yep. I'm going to Chromatic Star. Mm -hmm. Draw again.
we have time. We have time and we have resources, so I think this is fine to Sylvan scrying. Yep. Look for a mine. Yep. I don't use the last I would never use the last I would just die. Like, the Chicken Tron is seven mana. Yeah, a Tron, like, one, two, three Tron is seven mana from the Tower, Tower Mine, and Power Plant. Mine makes three. Uh, sorry, Mine makes two, Power Plant makes two, and Tower makes three. Yeah. Um, and then, like, the deck likes to cast Tron spells, which is Karn Liberated, which is seven colorless mana, All is Dust, which is seven colorless mana. Um, and then, like, there are bigger spells, but normally you just want to be casting spells for seven or six or that kind of thing. Um, so I found this, and then I'm going to put Gigant into my hand. Sure. <laughs> my turn? Yeah. I have not achieved Tron. I have uh, two towers and a mine. He has two towers. Because mm -hmm. I'm going to cleanse you with the fire in the mine. <laughs> this is... <laughs> this is incredible. I did not know that he had drawn the third, but this is incredible. When you cleansing wildfire somebody, you draw a card, which could also be cleansing wildfire. Yeah. That's how you do it. It it's it's now the question is just do I run a fourth? <laughs> I think he does. <laughs> which is he just didn't shuffle very well in all the sideboard cards were together. Yeah. This is game three. This is game three. This is for all the marbles. And I feel like I'm getting blood Blood Raid Elf. Yeah. Cascade. Ooh, that is a Tarmogoyf. That is a Tarmogoyf, but do we have anything else other than uh, sorceries and... <laughs> sorcery land creature over here. Uh, sorcery and land. An artifact. Oh, he's a four. He's a four. That's a big boy. We're swinging for three. I'd call that a four. Go ahead. So Goyf sees all, all card types. So, yeah. super types. Super card, types. card super types. You can uh, get to 8. You can be an 8 9. Yeah. Because Phil tried to get me on that, but experienced Goyf guy knows. Tribal. Have you ever had this on Goyf? Uh. Was there ever a sorcery or a tribal card? I don't think so. Oh, we'll get that. We'll get that another time. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. I think. I'll message him quickly. 1611, right? Yeah. Yeah, tell him to follow the stream. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Aren't you watching? I thought the same thing. I thought I was like, oh, it's for sure. So you can make two of them. No. But you don't need to. All right. There we go. Ugh. <laughs> I have been uh, poorly misplaying. Oh, have you? I have had a relic of progenitus on the battlefield this entire game. <laughs> yes, you have. <laughs> <laughs> Whew, that is. Uh, you only took maybe like. That is embarrassing. You only took maybe two or four extra damage, but. That is very embarrassing. Yep. Um. It's still... I thought maybe you're just saving it for the perfect time. I am. And, like, there is... Th this This time could be very well the perfect time. It could. But this costs five mana. And a lot of things in my hand cost five mana, including Gigantha. Yeah. So I have to choose one. And I think the thing I'm choosing is to pass. <laughs> yeah. He's just gonna, uh, like, just O stone and blow up my entire board, so. Go to combat. Yep. Well, that was. They're all mine, mine. Fair enough. Uh, no, I think I'm actually gonna. Relic. Sure. Exile Graveyard? Exile Graveyard. He's a zero one. D gens. D gens in the store. You took three, right? Uh, I took four. Oh, uh, yeah, I took three. Yeah, okay. I draw for relic. Yeah. Uh, no, you got rid of that. Maybe 
we do this? Gonna Croxa. Okay, uh, I think I can discard this Chromatic Star. Chromatic Star. I will pass. It is pretty close to close. So, yeah. I mean, like, you guys can start one if you want. I am going to cast a third Urza's Tower. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Mm. You almost have enough mana naturally to play all the big stuff. Nah, I don't think I can wait. Uh, it's so this this is so precarious for me right now. Yeah. Um, I'm getting all stoned. Yep. Pass turn. Yep. Yep. Close. Uh, yeah, we'll be here for a little bit. We got a peat land. Mm -hmm. Well, we might as well, I guess, do this and see what the hell we get. So, I will draw a card. I will Inquisition. Uh, you get nothing because Inquisition doesn't hit Karn or Gigant though. But okay, so we know what's going on there, but this goes to four. Yeah. Uh, combat. Yep. The super secret tech. Yep. Blow up the world. Watch him cast another Tarmogoy from his hand. Dead. Are you like a psychic? <laughs> Get a card check. Two. Four. Two after the goif. Yeah. So I got creature, sorcery, land, artifact. artifact. No instance. So he's four. All you. All right. Well. No, there's four in the deck. Oh, this is the third. This is the second goif? I think he exiled one I think that was the other game, but I can double check. No, you're right. This is goif three. It's the non foil goif. This is Goyf 3. <laughs> All right. I am actually, like, very close to dead. Um, <laughs> like, he could play a Bloodbraid Elf and kill me next turn. So, like... I think I do this because this might actually be very devastating. Um, <laughs> no, I have to play this Ancient Storms and look at the top five. Yep. I'm going to put this Karn Liberated into hand. Yep. Notably, he costs one more than mana you have. He does. Uh, then I'm gonna cast Gigantha. Yep. Uh, and I'm gonna pass turn. Oh my god. I'm gonna bolt you. Oh no. Oh god. That is real bad for me. Because that's a five and then he has a kill spell for Gigantha and wins the game. No, I don't. Okay. I do have a blood braid elf. I could find one though. No, that's oh, okay. That's not game. That's not game. We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. Cascade. We're okay. That's a land. That's a land. That's an assassin's trophy. God. Kills that. Damn it. Smack. <laughs> <laughs> Who doesn't Oof. love magic like that? Yeah. I mean, come on. I mean, come on. I was close to like three cleansing wildfires. Yeah. Who doesn't like that? You don't have to play a 
Uh, Dave. <laughs> that was pretty funny. It was good. No, like I didn't, I had some outs. Um, well, I didn't have any outs, really. <laughs> you, had, I, you had good defense set up there. I had good defense. Um, I had all his dust in hand, and my Ugin Sanctum, so like I could have killed your Goyf, but then you had the Blood Braid Elf. Yeah. Uh, and you could have... So that was the way that I would have survived. Those came out. Yeah. So I should have played all his dust. Probably, yeah. I should have played all his dust, found... Um, Coiling Oracle. Or, sorry, uh, Worm Coil Engine. Worm Coil Engine, yeah. Worm Coil was the one thing that would be very annoying to deal with because it takes multiple cards for me to get rid of it. Yeah. Which is... Mm. Those are good games, though. That was good. That was good. Felt like good old... Can you uh, hit the camera so that I am... But I won't be there for long because I think we're going to our final screen... Yeah. Pushing it back. Peace out, guys. And we're unmuted. Oh, okay, this Chris. time we're unmuted. You won? I won. You won. I won. Uh, what was the... I, I forget the matches. You won game one? No, I lost game one. Oh, damn. So, like, against Tron, that can happen. Like, he, he got it pretty quick, and then... But then everyone... Or well, not it was still a good game too, though. Even no, though, even though I lost land hate in the side. Yes. So Tron used to be a regular deck. So I had haven't updated my sideboard <laughs> since I haven't played Modern in forever. How yeah. many cleansing bottles? And there have there was only three. There, there was, was only three, three I didn't have before. I saw them all. Yeah. I saw so all I, of them. I started with two of them in hand and the Inquisition, and I was like, this is great. And then I drew the third one like almost right away. Uh, so so then I just got to play the game of like, oh, I don't even need to use this yet. I can wait because I knew it was in his hand, so... Well, yeah, and, you, and, like, you don't really have to worry about his threats if you're just managing his land, so you can kind of yeah. keep, like, a... Like, okay, I'm not doing anything for a bit, but... Yeah, yeah, and, and the second... not doing anything at all. Yeah, and then he wastes his uh, searches to go find something and then just kill it again and make him depressed. Yeah, yeah it was... Uh, <laughs> it, was, it was depressing to watch, for sure. Uh, that was fun, no. No, that was amazing magic. Yeah. Well, okay, I... Yes, it was a fun I game, but I knew he had two cleansing wildfires, and I, I was watching you play like into my hand every single match against him. <laughs> yeah. So I had a good time. Yeah. yeah, I I really love just like super interactive back and forth grindy mid range yeah. magic. Like it's it was just sad from like my perspective because Dave was like I could see Dave like moving towards getting his pieces to assemble drawn, and I knew you were gonna blow them up. <laughs> when he got I kept letting him. I got a little bit of hope and then crush it. <laughs> yeah, a little bit of hope and yeah. crush. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. When when he was like, I, I think I'm like, I think he said like, oh, I need like a power plant off the top, and you're like, okay, I'm just gonna. Just gonna off um, uh, yeah. Those would not be in the deck in the current meta. No. So uh, that was purely chance. Purely 2018 meta. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But these decks are also not in the meta right now, anyway. Right? Not really. No. no. Uh, there's like sort of a version of Tron sometimes ish, kind of. Yeah. Um, Boomer Jund is definitely nowhere near gotcha. super viable. Like, you can go to a tournament and go, like, 4 and 2 or 4 and yeah. something like that with it. Like, you're always in games, so, like, I, you're not favored, but you're in a game. And you can make things happen. If you so. wanted to play a game at a tournament, where would you go? Oh, that's a tough question, but... I think that I heard that next Saturday there there may be a tournament in Oakville at Enter the Battlefield Oakville on Spears Road on the 17th. Yeah. Uh, it is a face-to-face -face qualifier plus event even, I believe, which has four qualifiers for uh, the, the regional. Two, uh, which is the following weekend. No, the regional is farther away. For sure, I think. Okay. Well, regardless, yes, it's a while. It's a while from now. It's in like November. One of the last opportunities you'll have to qualify? Question mark. Yes, that um, is true. So cycle one is ending the week after. Gotcha. Uh, after that, so you have one week from that Saturday basically to get your qualifier to be able to get into the regional. Um, and we have four available. Yeah. And the store there is awesome, and the people there are awesome, and you guys should all go, and I'll be there, and you can come say hi, and 
Yeah. I will not be playing. I will be running it. Um, also, this deck would not win it, but... <laughs> True. But you might see someone playing Jund uh, participate. That's it. And if you do go there and you do play Jund, Boomer Jund, and you find me with the Boomer Jund deck, I'll give you something. Oh my goodness. Beautiful. Chances okay. of that happening are low, but if you do it, I will make it worth your time. Wonderful. Yeah. Uh, next week, we're going to play a variety of Magic formats. <laughs> Uh, we're calling the, it the filler stream. The filler stream, because that's <laughs> Phil, and he plays all these weird formats. It's a pun. We're going to do Dan Dan. Yeah, so Phil is going to just pull stuff out of his hat, hat yeah. and we're going <laughs> to we're gonna do it. Yeah. Where's your hat located? Uh, anyway. It's in my bag, but make sure, yeah. And also pick up your sideboard cards at the battlefield. Yes. Get ready, prepare for your Yeah, yeah, that's true for the tournament. Come get them all. We have yep. them. Yes. Uh, link in the description. Over here. Okay. 